So last month I went to Hamburg to visit a friend from my exchange in Portugal that I did three years ago. I woke up at 6 a.m. It was snowing, it was so cold, and I went to the station to take my Flix bus. So I was in Hamburg around 9. And I wasn't ready for the snow, guys. I was freezing to death. My left hand was completely frozen and I was waiting for my friend at the station. Afterwards, we went to the center of Hamburg and visited this store that had some high fashion brands. So after we took the bus and we went to Feldstrasse and we saw this flower market so we went in immediately because we were searching for some gems, oh, nice. especially for some rings. So the flower market in Feldstrasse is every Saturday from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. So if you want to find some great gems, just take the metro or the bus from the center of Hamburg and go to Feldstrasse to find this flower market. Found it. We found it, the smallest phone in the entire world. <laughs> hello, hello, we get the. This Bavarian jacket was so cool, but it was like 30 euros and I didn't have the budget at the time, but next time I will get it. And also this tartan blazer was epic, like I didn't have the budget, I was crying inside because I'm sure that it was of my size, so I hope to find it again. This stand was so cool, the promise that the prices were from 15 euros up, so my budget was like 20 euros, so I couldn't afford any of those things, I was just seeing what was good. So we went to the ring section and I found these two rings. I was uh, deciding on which one to buy and I bought the skull one for 5 euros so it was a big deal. And also to find a ring of my size because my hands are pretty big and my fingers are pretty big so it was a good deal. And then we went to other stands where they were selling like cameras, shoes or phones and electronics. This actually looked good and I want to try kids camera so. So after staying at the flower market for like 2 or 3 hours we went home because our bellies were rumbling and we were hungry so we had lunch at our house and we talked about 
what we've missed during these three years. Hello my fellas, so today I'm going to Hamburg alone for my solo trip to the thrift and firstly I went to Vintage Rags, uh, I was waiting for the opening of the store because the opening was like for 10 a.m. and I was there at 30 minutes past 9 so I went for a walk in the surroundings. And I got inside the store. This store is called Vintage Rags. It's in the center of Hamburg, not too far from the train station and bus station, I must say. And it has a lot of pieces from the 50s until the 90s, 2000s. And the prices, they range from like 15 euros up from what I saw. But the store is so big, so I, uh, next time I will explore it more for sure. And there are a lot of great pieces like varsity jackets, leather jackets, t-shirts, button-up shirts, suits, shoes, ties, a lot of stuff. So this store is open from Monday until Friday from 11 a.m. to 8 p.m. and on Saturday from 10 a.m. to 8 p.m. Then, after I went to the next store that is called Zeitgeist, it was not too far from Vintage Rags. So let's try these items together. So the first item I got was this multicolored vintage windbreaker slash jacket. It was so cool, honestly, like it fitted me like a glove, the colors were popping, were lit, but the winter is almost over, so I can't get any jackets anymore, and I will be back in Italy like in six months, so I can't get more clothing. <laughs> Unfortunately, I was crying. Then I went to the tie section and I found a cool tie, uh, a carton tie that I bought here for two euro ninety. Then I tried this jacket, cool color, but didn't fit me. And then I tried this other jacket and I wasn't feeling it, to be honest. Finally taking some sun after weeks of cloudy days, snowy days, rainy days, windy days, Germany weather is crazy out here. And this is the fit that was for the day with the thrifted cardigan, the thrifted tie, the glasses, beret, and vintage leather jacket. Perfect day, I must say. It wasn't too hot, it wasn't too cold. Like, I was taking the sun, just chilling and living my best life. So, I went also to this store called Second Lella, but it was mostly women's fashion, and I went to the Thai section. It wasn't bad, but most of the items were women's fashion from high fashion brands, but they were vintage. And finally, it was time to eat again because I was so hungry. I took my burger with some fries and I was waiting for the metro. I took the metro and I went to the flower market in Feldstrasse.
This day went so smoothly until I went to the flower market in first trace and back. The phone was dead, so I couldn't film anything from the flower market, and I was so disappointed, guys. Like I was disappointed on myself, but next time I will come prepared. So that's it. I will go back to Hamburg for sure for some more thrifting, and I also went to Hanover recently, like last week, with my friend. But we couldn't find any thrift stores or flower market at the moment. But we'll go back there next month, and I will do a vlog about it. And nada, I will see you very, very soon, guys.